What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. Yikes! Mercury retrograde officially doesn't come to the universe for four days, but we're in shadow phase of Mercury retrograde right now. So we're in the shadow phase. So upcoming, it technically doesn't hit until um, sorry, not March 10th, May 10th of 2022 but we're in the shadow phase right now but mercury retrograde has got me like whoa already in the shadow phase i mean my words are just like black so sorry <laughs> um but seriously um thanks everybody for all the love and support to the channel we're at 12,350 subscribers right now so thanks so much for all the love and support i truly appreciate all the love and support it helps support a uh, single mama one of her income streams single mama two kids so I truly, truly, truly appreciate all the love and support to the channel. Um, it, this is a free general collective reading. Type to side to everybody, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Free general collective reading. All right, so I received another download. They're flying in this morning. It's 5.35 a.m., 5.6.2022. That's, but that's where we're at in the current energetic space. So just saying, just saying. I only take the messages to resonate. Please don't force anything that, that doesn't fit. I just want to make that very abundantly clear. Okay. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess Row 5. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only. No cash up, no Venmo. If you think anyone else could benefit from the channel or the spiritual downloads, please feel, feel free to share my videos on your social media and word of mouth. I very much appreciate it. Okay. So the channel message I received was a significant therapy session is about to become very significant in the universe. Um... It is going to cause a therapist to contact authorities on a criminal, a very serious criminal matter of the past. That is what I heard. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Um, I heard hidden cameras too at the end. It was about 30 seconds after that I heard hidden cameras. So you plug it in, how it resonates. A very significant therapy session. It sounds like this therapy session has not happened in the universe yet, but it sounds like it's about to. Now, whoever is about to attend this therapy session, but you know, client, Therapist um, situations are confidential. They're confidential unless they hurt, they want to, unless the client wants to hurt themselves or somebody else. But how this is some kind of very serious criminal situation of the past involving hidden cameras. I'm thinking hidden camera in either your space or somebody you're connected to space. So, I mean, it's a criminal matter. So, yes, there's client confidentiality, part, um, there's client confidentiality laws there. Um, as long as, you know, you're not wanting to harm yourself or anybody else. Uh, but this is involving, I heard a very, very serious criminal situation. I think it might be an ongoing criminal investigation involving some kind of hidden cameras. I think this therapist knows this is what I'm thinking. Um, I'm not this therapist, but that's what I'm thinking. Um, it's so, it's so, it's about to be so that whatever is about to be revealed in this therapy session to this therapist from this client is about to be like some tower moment energy like serious truth bombs um because i'm assuming they're going to therapy so well one so it's not getting out to like the streets and everybody and their mama but it's it's criminal activity and i think whoever you could be this therapist or somebody you're connected to this therapist but i think this therapist knows this I think they know this or they're about to learn this and that's why they're about to reveal this information whatever this client is about to reveal to this therapist regarding hidden cameras of the past in a very 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 serious criminal situation i think this therapist might know it's an ongoing criminal investigation or they're about to learn it is and that's why they're about to reveal the information it doesn't sound like this therapy i mean it sounds like this therapist uh, abides by client patient client confidentiality but it sounds like it's a special situation here and um they're about to reveal it um it's some kind of truth bomb energy that's about to be revealed it does it hasn't happened yet in the energetic space but it sounds like it's about to to this therapist it's between a therapist and a client but like i said there is therapist client confidentiality laws there but this sounds like a special situation um and this therapist is about to realize it or has already realized it it's so bad they're about to go to authority so whatever truth bomb energy is about to be revealed in this therapy situation um it's heavy 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 information i'll tell you that um and I'm, I'm sure it's probably about to alarm the hell out of this therapist 
um, whoever this therapist is and how they apply. You could be this therapist or somebody connected to this therapist. Whoever you are, therapist, I, I feel you could be mask on a fem therapist, um, how this applies. But I heard it's about to be so bad, you're about to go through authorities. Um, so it's some serious, serious ass information they're about to reveal to you on the couch, on the couch per se. Um, oh my Lord, you plug it in how it resonates. And it's involving hidden cameras and a very serious criminal situation in the past. So um, I'm feeling I'm pulling you in, therapist. I feel I'm pulling you in. So you plug it in how it resonates, if that resonates for you. Five of Cups on the bottom of the deck. Regret energy upright. This therapist, this therapist feels they should have revealed this information in the past and they should have. They are about to step up in a huge way. It has just gotten a lot worse. Okay, I heard this therapist feels like they should have revealed this information um, in the past. Um, something has gotten a lot worse. So whatever has gotten a lot worse, I don't know if criminal activity has gotten a lot worse or the patient's condition has gotten a lot worse or what have you. I feel I'm pulling you in therapist if this resonates for you. Um, I heard you, you have regrets. You have regrets in the past therapist that you... Um, should have revealed this information in the past, but you didn't. I think you were trying to abide by the patient-client confidentiality law, which absolutely, um, everybody is entitled to that, right? Absolutely. But when you go around unlawfully sticking hidden cameras in people's homes, that's breaking the law too. Just let everybody know. I mean, that's the truth. Um, but I heard you have serious regrets. You didn't reveal this information in the past, but um, something's gotten a lot worse. So I don't know if criminal activity's gotten a lot worse or the patient's condition's got a lot worse that got, comes to you for therapy sessions or what have you, or something has gotten a lot worse. Whatever has gotten a lot worse um, and however it applies therapists, whoever you are and how that applies. Spirit messages you have for the collective. I heard you're about to go to th uh, to um, authorities. You're about to go to authorities. So whoever you are and how this applies therapist, you are a therapist. I'm feeling, I'm pulling in. Whoever this is for. Three of cups reversed, six of cups upright. Princess of Pentacles reversed. This therapist has had to endure a lot of stories, a lot of stories about someone, oh, I can't speak, boyering through a hidden camera of a family's, of a family in the past. They know it's extremely criminal and illegal. They've been trying to abide by the laws, but it's getting out of hand. They're about to contact authorities. It's about to be very effective. For some therapists, it's two plus patients. Oh my Lord, you plug it in, how it resonates. Oh my God, I feel I'm pulling in two plus therapists is what I'm feeling. Oh my gosh, this resonates with you guys. Uh, so I definitely feel I'm pulling in therapist energy, whoever you are. For one, you're dealing with one patient of like of this situation that has voyeured in, I heard in the past in the family's family space in the past and you have to basically endure story after story after story after story of this client voyeuring in through a uh, in a family's space and their own private um life um via a hidden camera of the past um and you have to endure these stories but you know i mean i'm sure you're trying to abide by patient client confidentiality and absolutely but these people didn't have any 
um, boundary settings is when they basically voyeured in through a family and through a hidden camera. But yet they want their privacy kept private. And that's probably why they're paying you the big bucks to do it. Um, but it sounds like it might be declining your mental health because you know it was wrong. For some of you guys, I heard it was two plus clients. So for some of you guys, you have two plus clients you have to endure these damn stories from. Yeah, I don't blame you. I Oh my God, that's terrible. But um, I heard you're about to go to authorities. So it might be two plus therapists about to go to authorities. Because it sounds like your whole day, even though you probably make a ton of ass money doing this, your whole day, your mental health is probably declining because you have to listen to story after story after story after story of this shit. And who wants to listen to this kind of shit? People basically gaining pleasure, voyeuring, through a hidden camera of a family? I mean, who? Nobody. Nobody. I mean, ew. I'm serious. Um, so three of cups reverse, you have no celebration in this situation, therapist. Um, for some, it's two plus clients you have to endure this shit from. Two plus clients. Um, so I feel your whole day, basically, or most of your day, is having to listen to this crap. Um, it's it's sickening. It is heart wrenching, is what that is. So you have no, um, you're not celebrating of the situation. And whoever is um, using you for your services, they know you have to abide by the patient confidentiality um, law. I mean, absolutely. But they broke the laws in the past, criminal laws, and you know this. So I think that's why you're about to go to authorities. I think you're, uh, and absolutely. Um, you might get guidance from it to see what you need to do. But that, I mean, if you're able to go to authorities, which I can't see why you shouldn't be able to go to authorities about this, I would too. Because obviously, if you especially, I mean, for some, you have two plus clients. For some, I mean, two plus. So for some, you have one client that's coming in, talking about this and talking about this and talking about this. For some, it's two plus. For some, two plus could mean like 20 clients. So your whole freaking day or week, you have to sit there Somebody on the couch talking about this shit. I mean, Lord, I don't know how it doesn't decline somebody's mental health. Six of Cups upright. It's somebody from your past is what I'm feeling. Um, these clients or clients or someone from your past uh, is what I'm feeling. But you're not celebrating about this, even though you're making mega bank, I'm feeling, off of these client or clients. You're not celebrating. Three of Cups reversed. You're getting paid the mega bucks as a therapist, a licensed therapist to do this. Hell yeah. But I'm sure it's probably, I'm, I'm sure it's bad helping you. It's declining your mental health is what I'm thinking. Even though you're making the mega bucks to listen to this shit. Definitely somebody from your past, whoever this client or clients are. Princes of Pentacles reverse. The stories have gotten a lot worse, a lot worse. You know, there was much more to the situation and you're right because it has been confessed. You've been putting the pieces together. No, it's definitely time to go to authorities. Uh, okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. Dear Lord, therapist. Uh, it's all about you in here right now. So... I heard you know that um, you know the story's gotten a lot worse. It sounds like some kind of stories from your client or clients. They've gotten a lot worse. I think it's in the money department. They're losing a lot of money. It's not you losing the money because you're banking it up with all these therapy sessions. They're losing money. And for some, it could be femme energy losing money or masculine that's taking on a heavy emotional energy that's lo losing money because they're coming up as princes, princes of pentacles reversed. So, um, this person, and I don't feel it's because they're utilizing your therapy sessions, even though I feel you're probably a good therapist and you're probably um, charged what you should charge, which is probably exp um, very expensive. 
Um, and I'm not even gonna lie. Um, but I don't feel it's from you they're losing money. I think they're losing money from this illegal business of the past where a family was voyeur, basically. But I heard you're putting the pieces together and you're realizing this. And you're realizing it's a criminal situation, a very serious criminal situation. Um, and you're about to go. And you're about to go to authorities. So um, you plug in and how it resonates. I think your client or clients is bitching and whining on the therapy couch because they're losing money over this illegal business or illegal businesses of the past involving a family and a hidden camera. It's exactly what I think here. And they're getting no rest and relaxation because of it, because we have that book below it. Ten of Swords Reverse, they're revealing it to you. And Ten of Wands Upright is giving you a heavy ass burden. Whoever this is for, therapist. Holy crap. Let me see if I hear anything else. This therapist is about to be a very integral part of an investigation. One therapist in particular that has many clients that was involved in this. Okay, so you plug in and how it resonates. So one of you guys definitely had, one of you guys has one client that was, um, that sounds like profited from this, um, Illegal voyeur cam situation of a family in the past. For one, you have two plus clients that have uh, profited from this. But it sounds like the therapist that has two plus clients that profited from this in the past, it sounds like you're about to be a very integral part of some kind of huge investigation involving this shit. So you plug it in however it resonates, but it sounds like you're about to be a very positive part of this. Um, how this resonates. Um it sounds like these people were manipulating the system. They knew they could go to you therapist and uh, for privacy and confidentiality purposes for the patient client confidentiality rule. But they didn't think about the family's privacy and confidentiality in the past when they were making money off of them. Now their princes of pinnacles reversed and they're bitching and crying and griping and complaining on your couch. Um, you should, you know, you can't selectively give people certain, you know, everyone deserves a privacy and confidentiality rule, period. Everyone does. No one should have to endure, especially a family. So these, this household had child or children in it. It wasn't even a single person household. They had to endure lurkers through a hidden camera. Imagine if the roles were reversed and you therapist had the hidden camera in your house or somebody you connected to did. I mean, it's not, it's, that's never a healthy situation for anybody. And I'm not blaming you therapist by any stretch because I'm not, I'm not. You're about to be a very integral, positive part of this. And my hat's off and kudos to you. Absolutely. Um, but I'm just, I'm just trying to get you to, you or whoever's viewing this video to look at both sides here. The hidden camera situation should have never happened with family. It should have never freaking happened, period, point, point blank, bar none. It should have never happen. So now, since it did happen and they all this cover-up shit has already occurred, now the karma of the universe is one of these situations, i.e. even though you're making a ton of bank off this person or people coming in, on sitting on your couch, venting this shit, I'm sure it's giving you bad health because your whole day, even though you're making a ton of bank off their ass or through their insurance company or what have you, you have to endure listening to this shit. I mean, is that really winning? I'm just saying. Let me see if I hear anything else. Several shocking series of shame events are about to occur with this situation and quickly. Okay, I heard several shocking series of chain events are about to occur with this situation and quickly. So I think it's you, therapist, about to make some power play moves here, is what I'm thinking. Um, there's at least two of you, therapists, about to do this. I heard you're about to go to authorities. So I don't know if it's federal level, state level, or local police level. Um, only you know your story, not anybody else, therapist. You plug it in how it resonates. 
All right. Love you guys so much. Everybody make wonderful choices and namaste.